breaking news. Earlier this morning, the Boston Police Department called a press conference where lead detective Emily Meyer stated that a body was found near the harbor. The victim was later identified as Julie Sanders, age 45, from Boston. Sanders is now considered the 10th victim of a serial killer called the Guilty Man. Police found a letter containing the single word guilty while searching the victim's apartment. Anybody who has any information about the case should call 444-5321. Well, hello everybody, my name is Fatu, welcome to Ghost Files, the face of guilt. So here we go guys, let's play, let's try out this new game. Boston. Is that my phone? Okay. Are you guys my clients? Hello. <laughs> Police, my name is Bethany Stenward. I think I know who killed all those people. My address is 19 Congress Street, apartment Stenward. Please hurry. Okay, new objective interrogate the witness. So, who are these people? Hello. Hey, Emily, the police psychic is here to talk about the case. Excuse oh. me now. I've taken a week off. I should be on my way. Frank, wait. I need that new safe combination. Here you go. Thanks, Frank. Bye. All right, bye. <laughs> nice meeting you. Emily, I'm a professional psychic, and I've assisted the police in countless investigations. Let me help you with the serial killer case. Look, I don't even Susan, know. Who I you really are. like you, but I don't believe in that spiritual mumbo jumbo. I have ten murders to investigate, and no suspect. If you don't mind, I have some work to do. Ten murders to investigate. Wow, there's a lot of murders. Let me help you with the serial killer case. I don't even know who you are. So, all right, hold on. I'm gonna familiar with my. Uh, I mean, familiarize myself with the surroundings first. I'll get back to you. <laughs> Let me take a look around. Okay, let's get ready. Batch gun, ammunition, perfect. Should really clean up this mess. Is that a butterfly? Uh, what is that yellow thing, guys? The yellow substance. <laughs> Car keys. Am I ready to go? Recorder. Thank you. Captain is in the meeting. Shouldn't disturb him. That's my boss. All right. Can I? Can I leave? Safe combination. Where is the safe? Where is the safe? Is it in another room? Oh, okay. Wow. <laughs> okay, guys. It's a panning screen. Didn't know that. That's the safe. Enter the exact combination from the sticky note to unlock the forensic tool safe. Turn the safe rotor right or left to the indicated number. Always start turning from the number you have just entered. So, right 70. L50. R90. L60. And R50. Perfect. Hey, Kirsten, hello. 27 will be your last time on stream for two months. Okay, so you are going to move away pretty soon. Well, good luck, E.T. Hope you get settled down soon.
my forensic aid. One of the equipment. Tools. UV light. What else? Uh, crime scene swab. Fingerprint stamp. Fingerprint brush. Okay, the whole set. Hey, Jimmy, is my forensic kit ready? Indeed it is. You can now compare fingerprints, blood samples, and bullets. Great. Thanks, Jimmy. Alright, thank you, Jimmy. Okay, so that is my forensic kit now. And these are my extra items. <laughs> They're not part of the kit. Less talk and more work, detective. Okay. Now can we leave? Can we leave the place? Okay, so here we are to interrogate a witness. Who was that? He looked like he was checking if anyone saw him. I have to say this looks pretty neat. I'm liking the graphic style in this game. Look at the detail. The detail in the buildings and surroundings. Looks very nice. I don't need anything for my bag at the moment. Stanward. Only name, but no apartment number. Map. Nice. Ooh, lockpick. Do detectives usually carry around lockpicks? Is that a common thing, guys? What a strange lock. Okay, missing some number there. Okay, it's a lockpick. At the moment, my life is like a movie, but I don't know which movie. Okay, collectible pictures. Who is this? Oh, I don't know which genre. Hmm. So let me ask you guys this question. What is your favorite genre of movies? What is your favorite? Western? Mysteries? Horror? Adventure? Only names, but no numbers? Which one is Stenwards? Mrs. Lovetsy. Not Stanward. Mr. Adams. Holmes. Lincoln. Matic. No name sticker. Maybe this is Stanwood's mailbox. I think we do have the sticker. From earlier, guys. Is there a number on the, on the box? No number. Can you call him up? Hello. Please help me. Can you unlock that metal gate? Unlock Some the metal gate? Me out of my home. He punched me, but Bonesy bit his hand and took his glove. He dropped this before he ran away. All right, I'll take a look. You're sure you live there, beyond the gates? Please, help me! Can you unlock that metal gate? Okay, nice dog. Is that blood on the glove? Wow. He is carrying one of the tumbler wheels. So maybe he is telling the truth. We need two more. Shabby box. Aha, uh -huh, another one, nice. Very nice. Magnet. Okay, what should we do, guys? I don't know. What do we do? Oh, I haven't played this bag yet. Oh, that's not the one. So this must be Samuel's mailbox, but somebody ripped the name sticker from it. Now, lock it. 
Oh, check for crates. Uh, brush. Uh, UV light. Bingo. We got one. All right, job done, guys. It's time to go back home. I think we are done. Oh, no. Still have more work to do. Try it open. Why can I use a lockpick then? Try it open, really. I have a whole set of lockpicks here. Try it open with what? Whoa, whoa, wait, guys. This is tumbler wheel here. Almost missed this one. That means we can actually open the gate now. Do we know the code? I don't think we do. Four digit cyber, what could, what it could be? What could it be? A special date or even here? And here is our first hidden object scene. There's a dog outside. Is that uh the homeless man's dog? Doesn't look the same. Four six three. Oh, we don't know the code. Empty circle is a good base for a sad or smiley face, or a face of indifference. <laughs> doesn't have to smile. It doesn't have to be angry. Um, use what can we use to pry open? Um, actually, no, we need a lock code, a three number code. What could it be? Ah, 718. And a paper playing. Okay, chisel. Use the chisel. Yes, standard apartment two hundred four. Back door entrance, new objective. We blew up the whole thing. Guys. Looks like someone messed up the intercom. On purpose. I can't go in this way, the lock is broken. I think that these types of buildings always have a side entrance. Looks like someone messed up the intercom. Okay, okay, okay. I can't go in this way, the lock is broken. I think that these types of buildings always have a side entrance. That's the side entrance beyond the gates. Right? We don't know the code. Can you tell me the code? Please help me. Can you unlock that metal gate? If you live beyond the gates, you should know the code. If you don't, that means you are lying, homeless man. Please help me. Are you using Can you unlock me? That metal gate? I think he is taking advantage of me, guys. He doesn't know the code. And he's supposed to live beyond, beyond the gate. So he is lying, guys. What do we do? I don't know. I'm a bit clueless right now, guys. Go back. There's an envelope inside. Oops. Making logs since 1986. Perfect.
Okay, are you coming with me or not? Wow. This game's this game does have very nice graphics, guys. It's very high definition, very high quality compared to uh, other games. Look at the details. Look at the sun rays, the reflection. Look at that. It's pretty neat.